V1, VR, VLOVE. Thank you for tuning in on our today's video. We shall be talking about V speed on our today's edition. What are V speeds? What are the various kind of V speeds? In this video, we shall be giving you a detail of everything. Meanwhile, if you are very new to our channel, please kindly subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our future uploads. Innovation V speeds are standard terms used to define air speeds. These speeds are derived from data obtained by aircraft designers and manufacturers during flight testing for aircraft type certification. Using them is considered a best practice to maximize aviation safety and aircraft performance. The actual speeds represented by these designators are specific to a particular type of aircraft. These are expressed by aircraft indicated air speeds so that pilots may use them directly without having to apply correction factors as aircraft instruments already show indicated air speeds. Meanwhile, in general aviation, the most commonly used and most safety critical airspeeds are displayed as color code arcs and lines located on the face of an aircraft airspeed indicator. The lower ends of the white arc and the green arc are the stalling speeds with wing flaps fully extended and stalling speed with wings flaps retracted respectively. These are the stalling speeds for an aircraft at its maximum weight. The yellow range is the range at which the aircraft may be operated in smooth air and then order with caution to avoid abrupt control movement. And the red lines is the VNE, the never exceeded speed. Proper displays of V-speed is an air wilderness requirement for type certificated aircrafts in most countries. The most common V-speeds are often defined by a particular government's aviation regulations. In the United States, these are defined by Title 14 of the United States Code of Federal Regulations, known as FAR. In Canada, the regulation body Transport Canada defines 26 commonly used V-speeds in their Aeronautical Information Manual. V-speeds defined in FAR 2.3 and 2.5 are equivalents for the designing and certification of airplanes, not for their operational use. You must know that these V-speeds are defined by regulations. They are typically defined with constraints such as weight, configuration or phase of flight. Some of these constraints have been omitted to simplify the description. Right now, we shall be giving you a description of the various factor kinds of V designated airspeeds. These speeds are unique to every aircraft type. We have V1, the speed beyond which takeoff should no longer be aborted. We have V2, takeoff safety speed. We have V2 mean, minimum takeoff safety speed. We have V3, flap retracted speed. We have V4, steady initial climb speed. We have VL alpha, designated maneuvering speed. We have V alpha tango, indicated airspeed at threshold. We have V bravo, design speed for maximum gauss intensity. We have V charlie, design cruise speed, used to show compliance with gauss intensity. We have V charlie echo fox, critical engine failure speed. We have V Delta, design diving speed, the highest speed planned to achieve in Thursday. We have V Delta Fox, demonstrated flight diving speed, the highest speed, actual speed achieved in testing. We have V Echo Fox, the speed at which the critical engines are assumed to fail during takeoff. V Fox, design flap speed. V Fox Charlie, maximum speed for stability characteristics. V Fox Echo maximum flap extended speed. V Fox Tango Oscar final takeoff speed. V Hotel maximum speed in level flight at maximum continuous power. V Lima Echo maximum landing gear retracted speed. V Lima Oscar maximum landing gear operation speed. V Lima Oscar Fox lift off speed. 
we make Shali maximum control speed. We make Shali Alpha minimum control speed in the air. V Mike Charlie Golf minimum control speed on ground. V Mike Charlie Lima minimum control speed in landing configuration with one engine in operative. V Mike Oscar minimum control limit speed. V Mike uniform minimum on stick speed. V November Echo never exceed speed. V November Oscar maximum structural cruising speed. V Oscar maximum operating maneuvering speed V Romeo rotation speed V Romeo Echo Fox landing reference speed or threshold crossing speed V Sierra star speed or minimum steady flight speed V Sierra Oscar star speed or minimum flight speed in landing configuration we have VS1 start speed or minimum steady speed for which the aircraft is still controllable. VCR Romeo 0 reference start speed in landing configuration. VCR Romeo 1 reference start speed in specific configuration. VCR whiskey speed at which star warning will occur. And we have VX and VY speed that will allow for best angle climb and speed that will allow the aircraft for a best rate of climb. These are the V operational speeds of all aircrafts with different values based on the type of the aircraft. With modern fleets, the cockpit actually communicates with the crews when these speeds have been attained. V1, which is the takeoff speed, is always Consider as so critical because once it's attained, even takeoff cannot be aborted, even if there's an engine failure. This is always because the aircraft will not be able to come to a final stop before the end of the runway. We shall be listing all the speed in this video's description so you can check it out later. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Meanwhile, on our next video, we shall be giving information about aviation communication, how latest and figures are being communicated in aviation.